Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Uh, today we're uh, hanging out in um, Altspace VR, which is the one of the social media platforms, networks in virtual reality. And um, here I have my, my desert with a really nice moon. Uh, here it's night, but uh, where I live in Europe is actually um it's actually day it's uh, the middle of the day so um here i have a um, youtube channel um youtube player i guess yeah and i i want to talk to you about something and that something is i'm i'm trying to lose weight I have already lost 30 pounds, I was um, 223, now I am 193, so uh, that's some uh, awesome progress, um, but um, I want to lose more weight and um, that's what I, one of the things that uh, I am currently working on, right? And um, so in virtual reality, we can uh, hang out here in the virtual world and figure out how to lose weight, you know? How to lose weight. How, how to lose weight in four easy steps. In four easy steps. Um, okay, let's see the four easy steps to lose weight. And what's going on? How do... How do I... Play this. Wait. Okay. No, it's empty. Okay, so here, click here. Great. Now playing. How to lose weight in four easy steps. All right, Seven let's see. Seven slices of bread. That's a lot of unnecessary carbs. Wait, what? Step two. Portion control. Hey, this when is too fast. To restaurant. Cut your meal in half and ask for a takeout container to save the rest for later. Step three. Slow down a bit, all right, buddy? Have your heart broken. Heart broken? And not just broken, but shattered. What the hell am I watching? A girl who uh, never loved you and never will. What the hell? Try to get your shit together and join a gym. Start going to the gym regularly. And Go to you the gym. And you don't know that much about exercise and you're way too weak to do pretty much anything but lift five pound weights with the old people, mm -hmm. do it until your sweat makes a puddle on the floor. Then go home and go to bed. And the next day, do it again. And then again. And then again. Then go to and listen to stories of your ex-girlfriend fucking around with gross and terrible people. Stories this is a weird video. You think they're doing you a favor. Pretend that it doesn't bother you. Pretend that being forced to see your ex at work every day isn't fucking killing you. Pretend that everything's fine. Go to the gym and make more puddles of sweat. Buy books. Learn about different muscle groups and how they work together. Plan out your week of meals. Try to forget her. Back to the gym, more puddles of sweat. You're a piece of shit. You are a piece of shit. You are a piece of This is of fucked shit. up video. After the gym one night, go all the way up to the top of the parking garage and walk all the way to the back. Look out at the lights of the skyscrapers of downtown and think about how every single one of those office lights represents a person. Try to imagine how they feel, what they're doing. Then realize that most of those lights are probably shining into offices with no one in them. Realize you're alone, that you're staring at no one. Become cripplingly depressed and try to locate your car. Go to sleep, go back to work, go to the gym, sweat, freak the fuck sweat. out on your ex. The next day, apologize. One day, she wears the necklace you bought her and tells you that she got it from someone really special. That night, you discover that Slayer's Angel of Death might be the perfect song to do squats to. Yeah, that's a good song for squats. Start to make friends at the gym. You used to look down on bro nods and fist bumps, but since that's how gym rats communicate, that's become the language you speak most often. Max and you spot each other on Wednesdays. Vinny and you spot each other on Fridays. It's important not to forget that you're a piece of shit. Work, gym, food, sleep. Over and over. More fist bumps, more sweat puddles. Your body changes slowly, then all at once. You hit your goal weight, pick a new one, then hit it again. You go out and buy new clothes. You receive wave after wave. Hello, buddy. 
I'm trying to lose weight and watching videos about weight loss and recording to YouTube. This will go to YouTube. You run farther and lift more than you thought. Wanna, wanna be buddies? You go home and eat a single chicken breast and steamed vegetables. You go to sleep. I added you as a friend. We're friends now. No. No. There's a girl you see a lot at the gym who always does these weird Buddy. exercises you've never seen before. You make it a point not to look at her because you're overly worried about looking creepy. Like that guy in the blue shirt who never wears underwear and always hangs around the lap pull-down machine. But you notice this girl is always at the gym when you are and seems to always choose the bench next to you. You turn up the Slayer and concentrate on making your puddles bigger. At work, your ex parades her new boyfriend around, flatly ignoring you the entire time. He's taller than you, in better shape than you, and significantly better looking than you. That night, you bench press double your body weight. You sneak a photo of yourself in the mirror and email it to yourself with the subject heading, you are a warrior. The next day, you are more disgusted with yourself than you've ever been, and you delete it immediately. You make puddle after puddle after puddle and eat single chicken breasts and work and sleep over and over and over and over and over and over. And then something different happens. The night comes when you're not the last person in the gym. It's you and the girl who does the weird leg exercises. You end up walking out at the same time. Her name is Melissa and she works close by. She asks you out to dinner on Friday, promising it'll be healthy. The leg exercises are pivoting curtsy lunges. You start seeing Melissa a lot, both inside the gym and out. You add a couple cheat days to your week. You start getting a lot less sleep. Your ex calls you late at night, but you don't answer. One night, you're walking Melissa to her car, and she says she wants to show you something special. You both stand there in the dark, mm -hmm. looking out over the lights of downtown. Isn't it pretty, she says, with all those lights? You tell her that you think it is, but it also makes you feel sad. All those lights mean nothing. They're just shining into cold, lonely offices with nobody in them. But Melissa tells you that each light is an empty office, but they're only empty because the people have all gone home for the day. Each one's a person who's at home, happy with the one they love. You look at her in the lights and she smiles. Something in your chest expands. Late one Sunday afternoon, you're writing out your rent check and realize it's been exactly a year since you started working out. You think of all those miles you've run, those pounds you've lifted, the chicken you've eaten, and puddles you've made, and it doesn't seem that bad. You realize that it's not about hitting a goal weight or lifting weights. It's about waiting, being patient, and trusting that life will slowly inch along and things will get better. After all, change takes time. But time is all it takes. Step four, no fruit juice, too much sugar. All right, so uh, what did we learn from this video? It, it starts pretty, pretty crappy, pretty shitty. Uh, it says to work out in the gym. So I should, I should work out in the gym like every day or most of the days. And um, what else? What else? What else? Um, let me let me get on my porch. Yeah. Okay. So I'm on my porch here, thinking about the video I just saw. Um, so. Check out Jash on Go90. Okay. Shut up. So I should go to the gym, exercise. What else? Well, I should eat healthier, less. Less shitty food, less calories, uh, less food, Gross. and uh, Do you have to sit so close to me? Poop my crappy. Uh, eat less sugar, drink less uh, sugar. My crappy. So exercise, hate your ex-girlfriend, eat healthy, eat less, 
eat less, exercise, hit girlfriend, know that you're a piece of shit, make puddles of sweat, make puddles of sweat in the... How does this stop? Brightside has good news for you. We've put together a list of... That's good. That's better. Um, make puddles of sweat. Make puddles of sweat in the... When going to the gym and exercising. Um, think about stuff, you know. Exercise some more. Lose weight and stuff. Um... Make uh, buddies in the gym, communicate with the gym rats, um, and uh, that was that was about it. I I'm gonna I'm gonna follow that advice. That that video seemed both strangely odd, strangely fucked up, and strangely good at the same time. Uh, explaining a year of your life. Um, how it works out and uh, stuff like that. Um, so um, that's about it. I'm gonna uh, get out of the get out of the desert soon. I have a new body. See, life is good, and um, I'm gonna continue continue trying to lose weight. And I hope you you like this video. I hope you find it, um, I mean this video, not the, the video that I showed you in virtual reality, by, but my actual virtual reality video. This is kind of kind of weird, kind of odd, but um, that's what I wanted to say. Uh, oh, this is such a nice sea. The sea is uh, looking cool, nice, beautiful. So I hope this helped you don't drink too much juice too much sugar um exercise do more exercise feel like shit it's healthier it less go to the bathroom take a shit make a puddle of sweat um and i'll update you on uh, my weight loss journey i have already lost uh, 30 pounds but um uh, hopefully i'll lose 30 more and then 20 more so maybe 50 or 40 pounds in total that's my my goal in the next year or so and uh, see how that works out and i think this is a nice format for making videos in virtual reality virtually enjoying our virtual world <laughs> It's kind of weird and and funny at the same time. So uh, I already go to the gym. I already exercise at the gym. Sometimes every day. Sometimes not so regularly. I do boxing in virtual reality and some other things like sprint vector that um, that uh, take energy, take your make you sweat. Um, I try to eat healthy, but I also like pizza, you know, so pizza healthy, pizza healthy, sometimes pizza wins, sometimes healthy wins, and um, thank you for watching everybody, and I hope you liked this video, and um, this might be interesting to make this kind of videos in um, different spaces and places in virtual reality about um, some serious topics and um, things like that. So enjoy the moon, enjoy the sea, enjoy the sky, and um, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe.